Hi everybody, Paul Richards here with PTZ Optics and in this video I want to show you how to do a multi-camera, multi-angle virtual set. All this and more coming up next. So as you can see here, I have the same set that I was in just a moment ago, and I'll kind of zoom out to show everybody what this looks like, but in a different angle. And this is what the professionals use all the time when it comes to high-end green screens. And I wanted to show you kind of behind the scenes how it works and uh, let you know that we're going to actually be showing, we're going to be finally using it in our live show this Friday, actually this Thursday in about an hour, uh, Women in Live Streaming, we're going to be going on air and on YouTube Live, and we're going to be using multiple angles, and I think it's going to be really fun. So what it takes is actually two cameras. So in order to show you this, I actually have my uh, iPhone actually hooked up to a DJI Osmo, and I've got the NDI camera app running here. So I can actually go ahead and show you behind the scenes what it looks like, and I want to also show you how I set it up in vmix behind me here in a moment to really give you a good idea of how this all looks but first let me show you the physical setup here so this is my studio i'll just pan kind of left to right here so here is um my angle one camera there um that's the ptz optics camera on the on the uh, little fancy desk there if you will um, and then over here in front of me I have my main camera my main PTZ optics facing me and I can see vmix on the projector there uh, secondary monitor just for you know monitoring different things doing a second desktop capture and then over here we have our broadcast nook so I actually have usually three cameras now sometimes I use two um, that's our auto tracking camera in the corner there, but I just wanted to show you that before I dig into what's actually going on behind the scenes in vMix here. So let me just pan over just a hair. One of the things I love about virtual sets is the ability to very quickly and easily kind of pan where you're going virtually. So behind me right here is is the vMix setup, and let me just move this to give you a little bit better view. Um, so you can see here and here. I have my virtual sets. So at the very top, there's three layers. That's my intro layer. This is my virtual set number one. And here's my virtual set number two. And I want to give a quick plug to Eric Pratt at virtualsetworks.com. We're going to be looking at lots of different virtual sets, but this was an easy one for me to do because he's got multiple angles and they're super great. So if I hit the transition button in the middle here, and I've got a stinger actually, um, it will fade to this camera. And the only thing you have to know from a broadcast standpoint is to look into the right camera f that you're, you're, you're broadcasting in at any given time. So all it takes is actually adding an input that has uh, the virtual set, basically two different virtual sets, one for angle one, one for angle two, and you could just keep going, but I think two <laughs> angles or maybe three um, are probably the, the all you need. So that is actually, uh, that's the, the basically the, the overview. Um, we're going to be doing more overviews in the future, and um, I just wanted to show you guys that quickly because I think it's a really cool use case for um, live streaming and we're going to be showing you guys a couple more different layouts of this in the future um, because we want to do kind of more interviews with multi angles in the virtual set realm so thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video don't forget to like it if you're interested in this kind of stuff and watch our live show coming up in just an hour so take care everybody Click to watch another exciting PTZ Optics video and don't forget to subscribe. Tune in Fridays at 11 a.m. Pacific, 2 p.m. Eastern to join our live show with new industry experts interviewed every week.